Every year, Volunteers for Outdoor Colorado brings together thousands of people across the state to help maintain and improve our outdoor spaces. Everything from developing new trails to fire restoration and community gardening. Next week, there's a big fundraiser to raise money for these projects, and our Katie LaSalle chatted with VOC board member Gina Lux to find out about the fundraiser and how it helps our outdoors. You guys also have a fundraiser coming up, Naturally United. It raises money for public lands and it's back this year. How did you choose your theme, Reunion 2022? Well, it's been two years. So we typically have an annual fundraiser. It's actually at the end of our season every year. And with COVID, we've had to cancel. We tried to go virtual one year. And so we are back. We are so excited to see everybody face to face again. So, so we decided to go with a, a reunion theme. And it's going to be such a great event because folks that maybe don't know much about VOC, it, it's a great event to, to come in and join because we're going to have a walk down memory lane, right? So you're going to be able to see all the work we've done in the last 40 years. And, you know, everybody is welcome. You can you can meet people that are like minded that love the outdoors. You can meet land managers and really learn about what VOC brings to the community. So VOC is involved in a lot of different projects all across Colorado. Why does a fundraiser like this really benefit the organization? Yeah, so much of our outdoor space is actually maintained at least partially by volunteers. Um, we are the ones that are going out and doing all of this work. So, you know, I, I think it's it's best encapsulated by, you know, one of my experiences. I was doing some fire mitigation. Uh, we were cutting down trees by I-70 at the same time that the Elephant Butte fire started um, over in Evergreen. And our land manager had to simultaneously coordinate a response to a fire and also do mitigation. And the number of hats that he wore in that day while also being super present and helping us do our job really just highlighted the fact that there needs to be more support to help with um, outdoors and and the volunteers are the ones that do that and so not only do we have staff that have to coordinate these thousands of volunteers but also the, the materials um, I once built a bridge in El Dorado Canyon and so I bring people to see that bridge all the time all of those pieces cost money and so you know it's it's really important that that we both build up our volunteer base but then also build up the funding so we continue to do all these projects you know Lux thank you so much for your time today thank you appreciate it and to learn more about how you can participate in the fundraiser or volunteer visit voc.org